You won't believe the list that this woman put together. This is gonna ruffle a few feathers, but this is my preference. The girl with the list has imprinted in my brain why I will never put myself or my body through all of that for free. So here we go. We're not before pregnancy, so we need to be married. We're not doing baby mamas here. And I would have my own clauses in there that would cover cheating, stuff like that. The next one is 250,000 allowance annually per baby i'm sorry guys they make like from 150,000 a year just to give birth okay so please don't come at me this will basically cover my weekly therapy sessions i'm gonna need before and post giving birth um, a personal trainer to get me all fit and healthy get my confidence back obviously like grocery shopping and just things that i would need to get for the kids like here and there if i just have an annual or monthly um, allowance equivalent to that i'm able to live comfortably not just for myself but for my child as well so i feel like as a woman i would just be sacrificing a lot so this list i don't think is asking for too much i will not be working i would just not have the capacity definitely have a housekeeper who could do laundry cooking cleaning all of that for six months i'm not here to suffer then it will be replaced by a weekly cleaner there on just to get me back into the hang of things like cooking um doing laundry things like that because i do actually enjoy that but who's going to be having the energy to be doing all of that when you've just given birth anyway next one i would also have a mummy makeover because my body is going to be destroyed internally and externally i think this is a given um also a night nurse a doula i love my sleep so a night nurse would definitely be mandatory so that i can get my beauty sleep uh, to be able to have the energy in the morning um uh, to be able to take over it will put me in a way better mind frame so next push present so either an apartment in my name a car or a business something that is going to secure me and our child or children um future should anything happen i'm always looking to add more onto this list because i'm very adamant i want to be child free but for the right man i wouldn't mind putting myself through all of that for the above first things first before we pick apart this list any man who's in position to do all of that for a woman should only be with a woman who doesn't require all of that she said that surrogates get paid up to 150k just to carry but surrogates get paid that much to put their body through that risk without getting the privilege of becoming a mother and i know the privilege of becoming a mother is a foreign concept but stay with me the mere fact that she will compare being a surrogate and being a mother from a cash in hand monetary standpoint shows that she don't plan on raising the child no more or less than a surrogate anyway and the rest of the list pretty much proves that she's talking about housekeepers nannies maid oh overnight nannies don't forget the overnight aspect of the nanny because she needs to be able to sleep and don't forget the no cheating clause in the prenup that's very important a lot of people sleep on that one that's how Jeannie mai is going to be able to take jeezy to the cleaners when they put behavioral stuff in the prenup you'll be able to touch the screen at the end of this video to see how i really break down how that works with in the Jeannie mai and jeezy situation but that isn't even the worst part yet because you would think that a lot of this was satire but a lot of women in the comment sections and a lot of uh, response videos are really taking this thing serious. Now, here's the worst part. Because I'm very adamant I want to be child free, but for the right man, I wouldn't mind putting myself through all of that. She literally tells you that she's not interested in being a mother. But if what she could take from you is enough, she'd do it. But good luck to her finding a rich old white man in London willing to do it for her, but... I predict a lot of pumping and dumping all the way until she hit the wall. Tap the box to see how Jenny Mai is using the levers of the system to steal Jeezy's money.